Welcome back guys to another episode of The Falcon and the Winter Soldier. What is the episode of The Falcon and the Winter Soldier we're about to watch train? It is episode two and it's called The Star Spangled Man. Right, okay, Star Spangled, that's kind of an American thing, isn't it? Yeah. Um, <laughs> uh, because, yeah, there was a reveal of a, a new captain. Yeah, tell us what happened. Yeah, exactly. Uh, we have, like, we had a little bit of two threads uh, going on with, uh, we had Sam, who is uh, tracking some sorts of terrorists and stuff like that. And these, like, flag smashers, I, I think they called them, who believe that life was, like, kind of better <laughs> during the blip. Yeah. And yeah, he he handed the uh, the shield to the government and uh, supposedly to be displayed in the museum. But no, they gave it to this new Captain America that we saw at the end. Yeah. Uh, and on the other hand, we have Bucky who is doing some therapy because it's mandatory for his uh, with his pardon. Thing. Yeah. Yeah. And also um, Sam is broke and he can't help his sister. So yes, as that's well. also a thing, which is like a, a kind of like a very human uh, thread of a story that I like. Yeah. I mean, because that made it feel like uh, more connection to Sam by knowing his some of his personal life and seeing him interact that way with the bank and stuff. Um, and yeah, and, and I, I said also in the last episode, I said, oh, Bucky would be a great captain. I, I mean, I know Sam was given the shield. It was for Sam, but Sam don't want it. <laughs> so I was coming yeah. up with a, <laughs> an alternate thing like well if sam does not want it then we just throw it away or do does someone who wants to do it stand up and bucky's in a perfect place to do that i know he's a war criminal and all that crap but he's been um given a pass and he's working on his health and i thought yeah i don't know i, I thought it would be pretty good to have an him. alternative yeah yeah <laughs> i mean it made, it made sense to me uh but yeah because if sam wants it then great but he doesn't seem to want it uh but this other new guy you said you might recognize his face after we stop recording, you wait. I think I know who that is. I, it might be. He got the same shape of face as, uh, you know, Damon from the... House of the Dragon. House of the Dragon, I think. But maybe it's just the shape of face. I need to see his full face. <laughs> yeah, because, I mean, I, I went back and had a look at his face and, like, when he smiled and I thought, I, maybe, maybe, maybe. But I, I, I don't know. It depends when this was filmed. I don't know, vice versa. Seemed a yeah. bit, it seemed a bit um, cheekier, but then again, the mask could have been pushing his face down. I know we'll find out, I get, I hope. Uh, but are you ready to watch this one? Yes, please. All right, then. Let's shut my mouth and get into the episode. Let's go. I think this is the new captain. This is the new captain. So not who you okay. thought. No. JW10. Okay. You nervous? Never. I've uh, been a captain before, obviously, but this is different. This is... Captain America. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody in the world expects me to be something. Do you think this is before his unveiling? Surely, yeah. And I don't want to fail them. They're gonna love you. The punk. He looks cool. Love you. Love you. Oh, right, It could be college football or something. You're up. John... Captain, uh, Captain America. And that's the way you feel, John McClass. <laughs> so don't get me wrong, this has been great. It's been great, but it's been a lot of handshakes, a lot of suits. Oh no, after the unveiling. Okay. I just want to do the job. This is the job, John. So yeah, John Walker, JW, that was his locker, yeah. This has got to be the band, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Super Bowl. <laughs> No, I know it's not, but yeah. <laughs> the Falcon and the Winter Soldier. Well, I mean, the first Captain America, he started like this, you know. At first, they he was very uh, symbolic. Yeah, it did, but he also was uh, super powerful. Yeah. Good morning, America. Yeah, you did it right, dude. I mean, I worry about him because he has no superpowers. So if someone picks a fight with him... He's a target. And how's the tour been? I know they did a big rollout for you, right? It's the greatest honor of my life. For those of you who aren't familiar with John's resume. Tell me. John Walker, first person in American history to receive three medals of honor, ran RS-1 missions in counterterrorism and hostage rescue. The okay. government did a study of your body at MIT and you tested off the charts. Wow. In every measurable category. Shit. Okay. I got big shoes to fill. Did you know Steve Rogers? Well, I was two years out of West Point when Steve came back on the scene. I followed his career very closely. He 
even though I never met him. He feels like a brother. Wow. Aw, Bucky. Is this annoying him or is he okay with it? He seemed to have a little smirk on his face. Oh, I'm not sure. Shouldn't have given up the shield. Hey. Good to see you too, Buck. Oh, cool. This is wrong. Hey, I'm working, all right? You had no right to give up the shield, Sam. Hey, you're not going to come here in your overextended life and tell me about my rights. It's over, Bucky. Besides, I have bigger things to deal with now. It's connections with rebel organizations all over Eastern and Central Europe, and he's strong. Right. The big guy. Yeah. Now, Red Wing traced them to a building somewhere outside of Munich, so that's where I'm going. I have a feeling they might be a part of the big three. What? what big three? Androids, aliens, and wizards. That's not a thing. That, that's definitely a thing. No, it's not. Oh, it Every is. time we fight, we fight one of the three. So who are you fighting now, Gandalf? <laughs> what do you know about Gandalf? I read that. <laughs> when it first came out. When it first came out. There are no wizards. Dr. That's strange, yeah. A sorcerer. Oh, ah! a sorcerer is a wizard without a hat. <laughs> but look, that's not the point. These guys aren't magical. They use brute force, just like you. I'm coming with you. No, you're not. Yeah, he is. Because it's called the Falcon and the Winter Soldier. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so what's our plan? I'm trying to be cool. So no plan. I have a plan. Great. Can you do that? You sure about that? Really? I mean, he is souped up. No! It's gonna land on, on his hand, on his arm. Grab a, tr grab a tree branch. Or not. Ouch. I have all of that on camera. You know that, right? <laughs> <laughs> Get out of my face, Sam, or I'll break it. Okay, head north. Come on. But putting a shoot on, I mean, even if it was too low for a shoot, would have done better for him than just jumping out of the plane. You're doing a staring thing again. <laughs> He's an intense guy. Look at you, all stealthy. A little time in Wakanda and you come out White Panther. It's actually White Wolf. That's true, they called him the White Wolf. Yeah, that's, that's so cool, that's badass. Yeah. Hello, how are you? Good, what did I miss? <laughs> all right, let's go. They're so cool together. So they're strong, whatever. Oh god, yeah. Alright, let's go. No, wait. I think they have a hostage. Or someone's hiding. That looked like someone hiding to me. Maybe, yeah. Oh. Oh, look at him, dude, going. Well, we know he's badass. We're stealing medicine, vaccines. So isn't there one driving these? Hello? Yeah, hiding. Bucky, talk to me. What's going on? Found the hostage. Make sure it's a hostage. Then she might also be with them. Ah, uh, look at that smile. Yeah, there you go. Also amazingly strong. That's too many. Oh no. Red Wing, be careful. Aww. I always wanted to do that. <laughs> but yeah, Sam is not as strong. No. Oh, okay. Hey, he's here! Captain America, okay. See what he can do. But no, I don't think it was the big, big, big dude. <laughs> Bad. Oh. Hey. You're really not going to hurt that arm. Oh, nice. He got so good with these wings. He's so agile. Oh, he's going to use a gun. Oh man, it, honestly, the action set pieces in, in, in this episode. Oh, could have used that shield. Get off of me. <laughs> could have used the shield. No way. Okay. <laughs> hey, that's too much. <laughs> He's special. He's special. But what can he do without the shield, though? Mm. And that's exactly it. He's good, yeah. but he's just not super strong. He's, I mean, he's above human. <laughs> <laughs>
How in the hell after 80 years are there eight super soldiers running loose? On the ride? I'm pretty sure it's one of the big three. Aliens, androids, or wizards. There's no such thing as wizards. <laughs> All right, then it's aliens or androids. Or super soldiers. All right, well, then we got to work together. That's not happening. It's 20 miles to the airport. You guys need a ride. Come on. I mean, they could fly, right? Yeah, I mean. How'd you track up here? I'm tracking you. You hack my tech? It's not exactly hacking. It's government property. He's not impressed. <laughs> no. Just stare like that? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Who are you? Lamar Hoskins. I need a lot more than Lamar Hoskins. I'm Battlestar. Battlestar? Stop the car! <laughs> <laughs> Battlestar. It's like, this is too much for me. I'm not trying to be Steve. I'm not trying to replace Steve. I'm just trying to be the best Captain America I can be. No, not, he's not trying to be Steve, but he, I mean, he is replacing Steve. Yeah. It'd be a whole lot easier if I had Cap's wingman on my side. It's always that last line. Welcome to Germany. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Oh, oh no. It took what's mine, find you and kill you, okay? They're already looking for us. I'm wiping our aliases off any public traffic sites now. Carly, we can't stay here for long. Wow, it was quick. We can't let the same assholes who are put back in power after the blip win. I need to know that you're all committed. Because after tomorrow, there's no going back. Interesting. So dur during the blip, other people managed to rise to power. One people. One war. One people. I see how it could have gone, though. Yeah. And then people got fired because the original people returned. They probably all messed everything up. We just got our ass handed to us by super soldiers. And we got nothing. Not entirely true. What did you take? Could just be info. There is someone. That you should be. Okay. Who? I don't know. Detour? We're here to see Isaiah. Tell him the guy from the bar in Goyang is here. All right, we're here. I'm glad he didn't rip the door off. <laughs> yeah, I was waiting for it. Isaiah? I just wanted to see if he got the arm back or if he'd come to kill me. I'm not a killer anymore. He's on a redemption spree. There's more of you and me out there, and we need to know how. I'm not going to talk about it anymore. <laughs> Yeah, so he's serumed up as well. Okay. The only way you could beat him, surely. You know what they did to me for being a hero? They put my ass in jail for 30 years. Why? Wow. Running tests, taking my blood. Even your people weren't done with me. I say it. Get out of my house! That's low, man. Poor guy. Steve didn't know about him? He didn't. I didn't tell him. So you're telling me? That there was a black super soldier decades ago and nobody knew about it. Is that a cop car? Oh god. Is there a problem here? No, we're just talking. We're fine. Did I see your ID? Really? I don't have oh, ID. Man, Why? Look, is this guy bothering you? No, he's me? not bothering Wow. You know who this is? What the fuck? I am so sorry, Mr. Wilson. I, I didn't recognize you without the cockles. Yeah, no, oh, come on. <laughs> Back up. Just wait here, okay? So just... This is not cool, man. No. There's a warrant out for your arrest. You missed your court-mandated therapy. It's like missing a check-in with your PO. Oh. I'm sorry, Mr. Barnes, you're under arrest. Ugh. He's gonna go peacefully. Well, I mean, yeah, no, at least I know now that I can't ever recall seeing Isaiah before. No. I was yeah. racking my brains. Sam, you, I'm Dr. Rayner. I'm James' therapist. So nice to meet you. Thank you for getting him out. That was not me. Christina, it's great to see you again. <laughs> oh, it was okay. him. Bucky's not going to be following a strict schedule any longer. We haven't finished our work. Who authorizes? Me. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> I mean, I, I do like him. He's no Steve Rogers, but still. Yeah. He's fine. I get it why you want me to talk to Freaky Magoo over here, but I'm 100% fine. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to do an exercise. That's something I use with couples. <laughs> couples therapy. <laughs> Suppose that while you're sleeping, a miracle occurs. When you wake up, what is something that you would like to see that would make your life better? In my miracle, he would talk less. That's exactly what I was going to say. <laughs> you guys are leaving me with no choice. It's time for the soul gazing exercise. I like oh this my one, God. Thank He's you for I love this. More staring. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's do it. Let's stare. Get close. He's a starer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, get close. They're pretty close. Oh, okay. Get closer. Well, which way Why do you, you have to have your right legs open? <laughs> <laughs> this is fun. You have now? All right. All right. Yeah. Good. We're locked in. Right? We're locked We're in. Close. <laughs> Very close. That's what you wanted, right? Guys, you need to look at each other in the eyes. 
Intense. Are you having staring contests? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> What's happening? All right. James, why does Sam aggravate you? Because of the shield. Yeah. It's not about... Why'd you give up that shield? Steve, yeah. Steve believed in you. He gave you that shield and you threw it away like it was nothing. Right, so sure. maybe he was wrong about you. And if he was wrong about you, then he was wrong about me. Okay. Okay. It's a personal thing. Yeah. And maybe this is something you or Steve will never understand. But can you accept that I did what I thought was right? I don't have time for this. I will squash it right now. And when we're done, and never see each other again. No. Thanks, Doc, for making it weird. <laughs> I feel much better. <laughs> I feel like they could have got somewhere if they'd stuck with this. Yeah. That was really great. But yeah, I mean, it gave him something to think about. What was rule number two again? Don't hurt anyone. Bye, Doc. <laughs> I think he's going to have to hurt some people. But you guys have rules of engagement and all kind of authorizations you have to get. We're more flexible. But isn't he? So it wouldn't make sense for us to work with you. A word of advice then. Stay the hell out of my way. Really? I would have preferred it if they'd all got along. Yeah, same. But then the show would be called something different. Well, I know what we have to do. When Isaiah said my people, he meant Hydra. Not a chance. That's how I took it. Yeah, same. He knows all of Hydra's secrets. So you're just gonna go sit in a room with this guy? Yes. We're gonna go see Zemo. Zemo, okay. Really diving into the lore. <laughs> as long as it's not Dr. Zola, <laughs> everything is good. <laughs> no, it's that guy. Do you remember? Yes. Oh, no. Wow. Because I thought that was the, the German who welcomed those ones in into the shelter and gave them chicken yeah. livers and i was like thinking oh he reminds me of someone i thought it was him but okay okay, so, okay zola okay um yeah you go Zemo. first <laughs> yeah uh i'm loving this like it's very um very movie style you know i feel like i'm watching a, a movie each time not like a show style like one division was very you can tell it's a show but here i've sometimes i feel like i'm watching one of the mcu movies you know <laughs> Yeah, I mean, uh, it ends really, really quick. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, exactly. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'm very interested in these um, in these flag smashers. Where are they going now? What exactly are they going to do? It's very interesting. The whole story I'm I'm following, I like. Yeah, because the the blip. Um, and yes, it's Zemo, not Zola. But yeah, that name was in my head already. Um, I, I, I we the blip happened. For everyone in the in, in the movies and all the MCU and stuff. But it also happened for us. Because we missed a big chunk. I mean, we got the Avengers during the blip. Uh, but most of the time, like, we we skipped all that. We didn't see how society was working. We got a little taste of it in, uh, is it Endgame? Endgame, yeah. Yeah, where we saw, like, you know, the, the fish. Five years later. The yeah. fish are thriving in the river. And, you know, there's actually whales and stuff, you know. and it, Yeah. Like every, there was other things that were thriving. And also probably people got put into jobs they would never ever get because they needed to fill positions. So everyone exactly. was given some kind of new chance. And then all of a sudden everyone comes back and then you lose those positions. So there would have been some kind of world unity thing going on. And now I'm getting that that's what they want back. Yeah. But the only way you can get it back, I think, is by killing half the population. And that's just, um, that's just insane. <laughs> I don't wow. know any other way you can do it through terrorism. Because uh, it just makes people more stubborn. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, we've got more episodes to see, so I, I won't uh, pretend to have any assumption about what we're going to see going on. Because I didn't even have a clue what this show was going to be about, other than Sam and Bucky. <laughs> that was it. <laughs> uh, but I'm mean, really enjoying it. Like I say, the production value and how everything feels like a movie. Each episode feels like a movie. We've only seen two, and the set pieces and the special effects and all the action have been phenomenal. So, bah. <laughs> really loving it, yeah. Yeah, I'm I'm loving the hell out of it. I, I love the I love that they're not best friends. There's a little bit of friction between them because the banter's really good. It's amazing, and yeah, that guy Zemo. Zemo, yeah. Yeah, he's popped up again, and that was the one that were had the message on his phone from his 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 wife and kids, or so his wife. Yeah, yeah, he was like. Uh, he, he's in one of repeat the repeat repeatedly, movies, yeah. He? yeah, 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 repeatedly hearing the message from his wife and uh, yeah. Was it a Captain America movie or an Avenger movie? It was hard to tell at some Don't point. Don't ask me. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I but, think it was on Civil War, but yeah. Yeah, it could be. But we we, yeah. we, we literally do remember him, so that's good. Yeah. Because um, I'm thinking, oh, man, if you just keep 
just taunting us with characters we think we might should know. Like Isaiah, I'm like, oh my God, people are going to hate us if we don't recognize him. And I'm like, <laughs> then he said he was just like Captain America, but even Captain America didn't know him. No. Okay, yeah. then I'm okay. Yeah, I can't remember him. <laughs> he might have popped up. He might have been like in, in a part, like during the original Captain America movie, you know, because he, he's an yeah. older guy. So he might have might have been in there somewhere, but there's a thousand characters to remember the names of. So I ain't going to. I ain't going to worry too much. Loving it. Can't wait for more. I know. I really like, uh, I like Bucky's sass and I like Sam's um, also sass. It's counter sass. If you like. <laughs> <laughs> it's very cool. I, I'm loving this. And I hope they, they don't get apart as Sam said. I really hope. <laughs> no, we've got uh, four more episodes left, haven't we? So yeah. Interesting. Yeah. Uh, I've got nothing else to say on this one. What about you? Yeah, I'm the same. All right then. Yeah. We'll catch you all in the next episode of the Falcon and the Winter Soldier. I still need to read it. Bye. <laughs> Cheers. Bye, guys.